Hello, bonjour. My name is Adia and I am in Montreal for three days. I arrived yesterday and uh, my check-in time wasn't until 4 p.m. So I spent the whole day strolling in downtown Montreal at a cafe, did some work and then grabbed lunch at a Thai place called Garden Room My Street. Thai food is actually one of my most comforting meals because they generally have vegetarian options and uh, complements my taste palette as well so that's one of my favorite cuisines and i try to explore it in every city that i go to I to montreal a few times before so it's not a completely unfamiliar city for me today my plan is to basically explore the city a little more than i have in the past i'm headed to this cafe that i've heard a lot about in old montreal it's called crew cafe collective and after that, I plan to go to a museum. Montreal has some fantastic museums. And then probably we'll also check out some of the boutiques. Essence has a store here, so I'd like to check that out. See you. cafes I have seen or ever been to. Because of Montreal's French influence, the architecture here is unreal. And now I'm headed to the Essence store. That was okay. They didn't have as many pieces as I would have expected. A sweater that I liked from Margiela, but I realized it was a vest without the sides. So you basically could just put it on, but there was no like side. I don't know what I'm saying. You know, yesterday I was so excited that it isn't as cold as it was the last December when I was here, but the nature was kidding with me. So it's really cold today and I'm wearing four layers. I'm wearing an inner, a cashmere sweater, another turtleneck, and then this coat. Headed to the Oasis Immersion now because I really want to check out some of their exhibits. Not sure if I can get into one of their shows, but if I can, that'd be amazing. I'm kind of tired and not tired because I have to walk so much or whatever, because I walked a lot, but because of how many clothes I'm wearing, you know? I don't know, it's a bit tiring walking with so many clothes on, layered up.
that was magical. I was kind of skeptical going into the experience if I'll get bored for 90 minutes, but I didn't even realize when the time passed. It was so engaging, the music, the colors. I could go for another session. So it was, it was magical, mesmerizing, all the good adjectives. The gloves are making my life magically so easier. I can't even tell you. It is so cold. And yesterday I was complimenting Montreal. <laughs> it's a 30 minute walk to Cafe Tenderies and honestly I don't mind the walk. Even though it's a bit chilly, I feel like since living in Toronto I have developed quite a habit of walking to places and it's gonna be really hard for me to go back to a suburban living if at all I do in the future because I enjoy walking and strolling through the city so much now that I can't imagine otherwise. all the way back and that's that's a little concerning given I have been walking the whole day but you know what I just said I love walking so I probably will walk just had a carrot juice mocktail over there because my battery is almost dead I am rushing home now I have Uber on my phone Makes me sound like an idiot I'm back home now and I have ordered from my favorite vegan sushi place here in Montreal called Sushi Momo It's not very healthy because most of it is fried or has fried stuff in it but it's so delicious and you saw I had a full day of fun, right? But I'm so anxious right now. There's no reason for me to be anxious. I had fun. I love the art experience. I haven't eaten a lot, so I'm famished. But that's no reason for me to feel the way I'm feeling. Oh, it's just ridiculous. I ask my mother and my mother keeps telling me, you know, do yoga or meditate but it's so hard to meditate nobody talks about how hard it is to meditate because the whole point of meditation is close your eyes and don't think about anything but all i can do is think about stuff my food came let's see if food takes away my anxiety this is some extra what is it called? Ginger. Extra ginger. I ordered some extra ginger. I don't know. I am actually a ginger girl. I love ginger with sushi. I love it. I always put a little too extra with, with each slice. Unfortunately, I don't have... Uh, they didn't give me... It's so good. They didn't give me any chopsticks, so... Oh wait, did I wash it? I just dropped all the soy sauce. I'm watching this show called Silicon Valley and I'm quite enjoying it, you know? It's nice to know the tech scene and how real it is. I'm married to an engineer, so I know a little bit about it, but 
kind of giving me a good perspective. Let's enjoy some sushi. Just had dinner. It was delicious. I ordered three sushi rolls and I got one for free. And I thought that was a lot of food, but I finished the three I ordered, which is strange and concerning, but I think it's okay. Tomorrow, I may check out some of the boutiques that I wanted to today, but it got dark so early that I couldn't just do it. Good morning. It's day three in Montreal. Yesterday, I had so much fun exploring the city by myself but it got dark so early that I couldn't do so many other things that I had wanted to. I leave today in the evening so I thought I'll take some time today to explore and I'm headed to the old Montreal neighborhood again. I wanted to check out some of the home goods stores, some boutiques. that was fun I didn't find anything interesting to buy but I am getting late now so I am headed to Dandy for lunch and after lunch I'll be heading to the airport back to pavilion hopefully Dandy doesn't have a huge line I wasn't even recording. <sighs> kind of tired. I don't know. I was blabbering for the last 